Who the fuck are you? dead on arrival after being shot on Seiryu clan turf. It was a bloodbath. And the killers got away before the cops even showed up. Sounds like this isn't over by a long shot. Even as we speak, Captain Takabe is taking matters into his own hands with a truck full of Yakuza, all armed to the teeth. Doubt Chairman Hoshino even signed off on it. Tetsu, Koji, they'll answer for your deaths in blood. Probably heading straight for Restaurant Row. Yeah, right into Liumang territory. So, Takabe is heading to Restaurant Row, huh? That's right where the Liu Meng boss has his front. He's basically a lit spark flying into a powder keg. This is ridiculous. How can it be this easy to destroy a years-long truce? Mabuchi's got everyone dancing to his little tune. And he used us to make sure everyone heard it. At least now we know for sure he killed Nonomiya. Yeah. I remember his shit-eating grin as he said that. We still don't know why he did it, though. Yeah... You thinking of something, Adachi-san? Hmm? Yeah, yeah. Just... something Mabuchi said. I'm trying to remember the exact words. Who cares what that son of a bitch said? Adachi-san, are you wondering if Nonomiya was killed... because of us? What? But we had nothing to do with it. Especially you, Sachan. Yeah, I know it wasn't our fault. It was Mabuchi's. But maybe we were a convenient tool for him to get the war he wanted. I don't know, Sachan. I mean, we weren't even a blip on it. Wait. Wait, I get it now. You do? Listen, on the surface, it makes no sense for him to kill Monomiya, right? Right. We know his true objective is war with the Seiryu clan. Yeah, that's a given. He didn't need a reason to start one. He could have just done it. But instead, he used us as an excuse. Why? You tell me, detective. Think about it. If it got out that he was stirring the pot, what would happen? Well, the other organizations would retaliate. Exactly. This is Yokohama, where the Ejin Three have a strict agreement never to invade each other's turf. Anyone who dares break that rule would be punished by all three factions. Even if that person is a Liu Meng officer, like Mabuchi. So he needed to put the blame on someone besides himself. But why us? Think back to what he said. It all starts to come together. I was actually starting to worry that no one would water the seeds I planted. But then you showed up, and now that seed has blossomed into the most beautiful flower. He was saying that his master plan was complete. Get it? The seed was Nonomiya's death. We watered it by chasing the murderer. And the video he took to show his boys and get them all riled up. That was the blossoming flower? That's what I'm thinking. Also, I don't think he wanted us in particular. He just needed someone, anyone, to water the seed. Nonomiya died? For that? I don't think there was anything special about Nonomiya either. What? I think he was chosen only because his shop was on Seiryu clan turf. Mabuchi just needed there to be an untimely death of someone connected to the Seiryu. 
that anyone who reacted to it would serve as his spark for war. Nonomiya and all of us are the pawns in Mabuchi's scheme, but I mean, it could have been anyone. At least we're alive. Nonomiya is dead. Yep. Just because Mabuchi needed a roundabout way to start a war. You must have heard the old secret about how to win wars. Force your enemy to act first. God damn it, Adachi-san. You saying all we did was help Mabuchi's plans? <sighs> yeah. <laughs> that evil bastard has to pay. No way am I gonna let everything go according to his plan. Cool it. Kasuga. We need to stay calm right now. Yeah. Mabuchi's 